I will be showing you the best three sawmill setups, ranging from the simplest one to the most advanced one. They're all very useful and at the same time easy to build. So let's get straight into the video. The first sawmill setup is the beginner sawmill setup that lets you unload your car with ease and automatically load your car. And it only costs $400. The materials that you will need are two straight conveyors, two tilted conveyors, and one funnel conveyor. It's very easy to build. Just place two wall blueprints like this, and place the sawmill on top of them, you can use any sawmill you want. Then place your straight conveyor and a funnel conveyor. And finally place another straight conveyor here and two tilted conveyors. And place your car spawner under the conveyors by rotating it. And that's it. Now after you unloaded your car, quickly respawn it and it will get loaded automatically. For more comfort, you can have two cars. The second sawmill setup is the advanced sawmill setup. It includes an auto unloader and a car loader. The materials are four straight conveyors and four tilted conveyors. And you will also need 81-4x1 wedges and four smooth walls. To build it, start off by placing a tilted conveyor and three straight conveyors. Then place your smooth walls here. Then make the ramp out of wedges. And finally place a straight conveyor and three tilted conveyors. Like before, turn the car under the conveyors. And that's it. Now when you drive up the ramp, respawn your car, all of the wood will get loaded in your car. So I will now show you the most efficient sawmill setup, the professional sawmill setup. It includes a big and efficient auto unloader, a wood storage, and a car loader. You can choose yourself for where the wood it should go, in the storage, or in your car. You will need lots of materials, 9 straight conveyors, 19 tilted conveyors, 1 straight conveyor switch right, 1 tight turn conveyor, 1 button, 5 wires, and 1 funnel conveyor. Then go in fancy furnishings, and buy 8 large glass panes. You will also need 21 slash 4 wedges. So after you've got all the materials, let's start building. Start off by placing 7 straight conveyors leading into your sawmill. Then you'll need to build the ramp. You can place 2 smooth walls and 1 short smooth wall to help you place the wedges. You can later delete the guiding blueprints. Then place eight tilted conveyors on the sides. Also make sure the conveyors have the right direction. Then place a switch conveyor, for tilted conveyors, and a funnel conveyor. Then rotate the car spawner under the conveyors. And put two straight conveyors, one turn conveyor, and place seven tilted conveyors. Then make the wood storage box out of glass panes. Then finally place your button and connect it with your car spawner with wires. Mm -hmm. 
Once you push the button, your car should respawn. So you have to drive up, push the button, and then choose where you want the wood to go. This setup is pretty big, it's 15 large floors long, and it will be even longer if you use the Sawmax 02L, so you will need a lot of land to build it. But if you don't have enough money to buy the materials, then you can later watch this video to see how to get the best wood and earn a lot of money.